I'm letting go. I'm letting go. Repair. Wait, how is it still tracking? Okay, okay, but if it was in Blanco and like someone stole it. If this is the moment of truth. We're gonna have to let go. I, 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 oh. Someone's gonna have to jump the fence. Oh, that could be the final spot. It doesn't even show up. It's fine. This isn't gonna work. No, it definitely isn't. So to pull this whole thing off, we had to gather a few supplies and do a little bit of research. Thankfully, people in the past have sent burgers, garlic bread, and ice cream cones to space, which gave us a little insight into how this whole sending stuff to space thing works. I ordered a used GPS tracker from eBay, two weather balloons, a parachute, and of course, a physical Dogecoin replica from Amazon. Basically, there are three main components that go into sending something to space. The payload, the parachute, and the balloon. The payload is what's going to house the GPS device, the GoPros, and of course, the Dogecoin. After the balloon reaches its bursting altitude in space, the parachute will deploy and send it safely back to Earth. Originally when I was thinking about making this video, I thought it was going to be just as simple as putting everything in a styrofoam cooler and sending it off to space because that's what every other video looked like, but it was not as easy as that at all. I really didn't know this until I started making this video, but it seems pretty obvious now, but there are restricted air spaces, like around all cities because planes fly there and stuff. So I'm researching right now like where I can and cannot fly. Um, so I'm gonna have to pick a spot somewhere outside of this red circle so we don't hit any planes and are good and stuff. Then it came down to assembling the actual payload, which we did in a very scientific way. Sticking out like this. Like you could do it like. So how is it gonna hold it? We'd have to like duct tape it down. Can you see the doge coin, Lily? Yeah. Like imagine the background is like the, the, earth. Cur the curvature of the earth. <laughs> it's just gonna take forever. We got an inch in like 30 seconds. So I've been researching this whole restricted airspace thing and we're planning on launching it from Austin in a field somewhere. And based on like the specific spot, I think it's gonna land somewhere in the Fredericksburg area, like two hours away. So that's just my guesstimate right now. There was one really big problem though. It was a lot more difficult to get helium than I expected it to be. Hi, I was wondering if you did helium tank rentals? Um, we don't do rentals, you just have to buy it. Do you guys have helium tanks for rent right now? No, unfortunately we're all out right now. There's a big shortage going on. I was calling to see if you guys did helium tank rentals. We do. Uh, do you know how many balloons you're needing to fill? Well, I'm actually trying to fill one large balloon. And what size balloon are you needing to fill? It's, it's like eight feet, I think. Uh, yeah. It turns out there's a nationwide helium shortage going on right now. Thank you for the heads up, America. So we're going to this helium shop because it's literally the only place in Austin that has helium because there's a na national helium shortage. Um, I think we got, whoa, look at that. <laughs> Didn't even that get on camera or is it blown out? Um, so yeah, hopefully this is going to be enough helium for us tomorrow. We still got to do the calculations later today to see how we're going to get it up to space, but it should be enough. Oh, oh, open oh, oh open. we got the helium tank, but you need a tank regulator, which this one did not come with. And no one just rents out tank regulators because I guess you'll never bring them back. Like no one trusts you. So I might just have to go spend another $60 on a tank regulator that I'll never use again. A few minutes later. I had to drive 30 minutes away, but I found a used helium regulator five minutes before the store closed. So we're back in business. The flight is still on. This is a big find. I wonder if I would go to jail or just read. Yeah, well, we're that's what we were talking about. about it. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone, I don't know this man. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing here. Nothing's happening here. <laughs> Nothing is here. Keep going. That's how the guy rolled it at the place. Don't mind us. It's the one massive tank of 
Residential neighborhood. If I saw this, I might call the cops. I don't know, rip off the top first, see if it's GoPro, and then just take it easy. I'd also do maybe the front. It's pretty far. I understand how sitting stuff in space is not illegal. I think it is. I need to. Okay, hold on. Hold on. <laughs> Again, Parker and Lily, there, read in the belly of the beast. And that's when things started to go south. Reed's out here I playing Bloom's time. Tower Defense, huh? I know, people call her useless. <laughs> we don't need the GoPro anymore. All right, so the goal was to get it 80,000 feet up. We did get it. Let's see. One, two. I mean, we thought it was all over. Except you know I got that extra balloon at checkout. <laughs> See you later, Doge. All right. Three, two, one, launch! Hi! Ah, we did it! Yeah! Just watch. Just watch. Now. Ah! Uh oh, that bird's going for it. So, just went to where is this? Barton Creek, we're headed out to Fredericksburg? Um, <laughs> John City, hopefully it didn't pop. Uh, we'll How far away? You. So it's about 30 miles away from us and I think it's gonna take us like an hour and a half to get to where we're trying to go to. So we'll update y'all when we get further down there. Yeah, imagine if we were like chasing it, like storm chasing yeah, yeah. like tornado chasing yeah, That's pretty cool. The balloon's in Blanco now, okay? <laughs> the balloon's in Blanco now. We We're gonna have to ride in a freaking hour. Basically, we thought the balloon had landed in Dripping Springs. We, we just found out it's a good we have, we have another. You who don't live in Texas, it's really far. Like it's, it's, it's another a, 45 minutes. <laughs> We're halfway to Curtis. Like, how is still it still, still tracking? Track? Okay, okay, but if it was in Blanco, Small, that, that could be the final spot. We're gonna end up in Blanco. Also, there's, in the middle of nowhere? there's no way I'm anyone got it from the middle of here to the middle of <laughs> here in the time that just taking it's definitely <laughs> still blending. It's like it's like pretty south of Blanco. Okay, it's not that far. It looks like it's slowing down. Or like it's getting Yeah, it's Alright. We play God's plan. I will say, think about this. God's plan included us setting a doge point of the earth and spending hours to go climb it down. Alright guys, um we are Five minutes, I think, from yeah. the Doge where it says it's going to be Tell on the how satellite. Long we've, been in this damn car. <laughs> <laughs> we've been in the car for about what an hour and a half, yeah. maybe. Um, oh so gosh, yeah. it's looking like it's going to be here in five minutes. Yeah. So we'll we'll see if it it came down to one piece. Hopefully, we got the footage. We're and we're one minute away from another um, update from the tracking app. Oh, what if it's um, oh. that's things got a little dicey. It's this. It's oh. closed. It's closed. Keep going a little. A little break. Someone's gonna have to jump the fence. <laughs> Do you want this or not? They're trying to fight it right now. 
We have no idea what this is going to be. Well, this is where it was supposed to be, and we're like right here. All right, we'll just come back. We don't need the f***ing doge anymore. If anything, it's like back from where you came. Where is it? Dude, we've Wait, been looking kind of for... Oh my god, is no that way. <laughs> No way, no ah! way. Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Oh my god. The dogecoin is missing, but everything else is here. With the payload! I just hear them talking. It was charging it was all the time. charging. Well, that's good. So, where do we wow. want to put this? There's no room. Oh god. I don't even know if we can get off the, the command strip. There it is. I didn't know it was recording. Okay, there's a video that's one hour and two seconds. That's, that's good. good. That's good. good. So that's it might have gotten it. You know, we secured the bag and we secured the footage. All in all, pretty successful flight. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, consider sharing, subscribing. I'll be putting out some new videos soon. And uh, yeah, until then, thanks again. I'll see you next time.